All right, everyone. Well, it's time for round two, and there, there's no way around this, really, but obviously, big spoiler, I didn't get Escanor in the first round. So, like I said, though, 2,400 plus gems to start off, and one of two things is going to happen. I'm either going to get Escanor, or I'm going to go broke. So, let's get right to it. Here we go, the first multi of part two. All right, now I'm starting to get a little bit worried because, you know, 2,400 gems is a lot. So, you know, let's just get Escanor in the first multi here and then we are we don't have to worry about anything else. And we're good to go. Although it's not looking super hot so far. We got Hawk, but... Hawk actually shows up a lot because of uh, Blue Melodious. Oh man, not a, not a, are we gonna get, is it gonna be as bad as the last, the last first multi? Where I only got one SR? A little bit better. Okay. Stock it up on those coins though, which is nice. Number two. Oh man, we are over 500 gems now. I wasn't quite there after the first one. Oh, he's got the sword. Is he gonna win? Nope. Not looking good. Not looking good. Oh, that's a that's a dirty one right there. Yikes. All right. A little bit of a rough start, just like the uh, the last round. But you know, I'm getting used to it. I'm getting used to getting shafted. It's it's crazy, but it, it it's like you slowly start to uh, learn to expect this. Oh, there we go. That I was not expecting though. All right. End my suffering, please. Just one. That's fine. That's fine. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Yes. Yes. All right. Whew. Oh, I was starting to get a little worried there. I was starting to get a bit worried. Once you get to 500 gems, that's when you start to get worried. Oh boy. Well, this is a little awkward because what are we at? Three and a half minutes? You know, I was thinking about like what I would do if I did a bunch of summons um, and then like ended off part one and then I got what I was looking for really early on in part two. Because it's obviously a pretty big spoiler if you like put out a five minute video um, and you know, it's just like, okay, well then obviously he got him, right? So I was thinking if like, you know, you should add, maybe I could just add like 10 minutes of a black screen or something, but that completely messes up the YouTube algorithm. I've, tr I've tried it before and it just, it tanks your, your videos. Like they all just do terribly if you do that. Because YouTube thinks like everybody leaves your video after three minutes, but it's a 15 minute video. So, you know, obviously people hate your video, right? So they don't promote it. It's, it's dumb. I hate the way that it is, but it is what it is. So if you have any suggestions, like how to avoid this in the future, because it's obviously a pretty big spoiler when you put out short videos uh, that you got who you're looking for. So I'm open to any kind of suggestions. But anyway, we are donezo. Nice to uh, have a good reserve of gems for whoever I will be summoning for next. So uh, you know what? Okay, I think I solved my problem. I'm going to go ahead and finish off this round. I'm going to do that because that'll, first of all, make the video a little bit longer. And I don't want 40% of the draw bonus to go to waste. So, okay, we have a temporary solution. 
And I'm going to uh, get a delay, not delay it, but I'm gonna like let it play out just so the video is a little bit longer so it's not as big of a spoiler that I obviously got Escanor early, so. Because I've read a lot of comments about that. It's like, honestly, it makes sense if you think about it, right? I think I even have a two minute summoning video out where I got who I was looking for and it's like, okay, pretty obvious you got them if it's a two minute video. I don't even have ads on this channel, so it's not it's not for ads, not monetized or anything like that. It's it's really for the uh, lack of spoiler. What if I got another Escanor in the next couple of multis? How crazy would that be? But if you have a um, if you have a better suggestion in the future, like how to kind of deal with this problem, besides just keep summoning, of course, or finishing off the uh, the pity, feel free to uh, to let me know. Oh, you know what else I can do? I can uh, summon my. Uh, SSR tickets. I think I have eight of them actually. I've been saving them up for a while, so I can throw that into the end of this video as well. All right, I can't do it. If I don't, if I don't know that there's an SSR there, it's like really tough to go through that. So I don't think I can do that again. It's a little, a little too painful. Let's finish off this, uh, this draw bonus though. I'm okay with the few shafts, you know what? Even though, obviously I got Escanor, but like, if you look at all those summons that I did overall, I don't know about that RNG, like, I probably should have gotten a couple more SSRs, but you all know there's no such thing as should have with RNG. Those two words don't really work very well together. All right, I got one more, we got the guarantee, and then I'll do my, uh, my summoning tickets. Maybe we'll see the uh, Escanor animation on the uh, on the guarantee. <laughs> All right, this is it. We got our guaranteed SSR. Maybe we'll get two. Sun? No, no sun. Alright, just one, just the guarantee. That would be pretty crazy if it was another Escanor, though. I would have, I would obviously be happy with it, because I eventually want to get six, but... That might trigger a few people if I, if I get another Escanor on the guarantee. I don't think it's going to happen, though. I have not had the best luck on the, uh, on the pity SSRs. Yeah. 
All right, it's coming up here. Here it is. Oh my god, I, I, I have no words. Are you kidding me? This guy, this guy is not even on right up. And for some reason, in my Eskinor summons, I got three of him. Three of him in my Eskinor summons. He's taken up like half of the SSRs that I've gotten. Oh man, this game really wants me to build a Gallon for some reason. That guy shows up in my guaranteed SSRs a lot. Okay. So let's uh, let's do my SSR tickets as well to, to juice things up a little bit, you know, end things off with a bang, and I can get my uh, let's see, let's get my my last ticket reward here, and I think I've got eight of them. Let's see, oh, I've got nine of them. <sighs> Is there any way I could have gotten gotten one more? I don't think so, but that's still a lot. I. I I guess I... All right, let's go for it. I miscounted by one. That's good, though. All right, Red Helbrum. That's really all I... All, anybody else is just coins or dupes. Oh, we got uh, the sun. I guess I'll let the... I, I can't skip the Escanor animation. That would be treason right there. So I'll let the Eskinor animation play out, but I'll, I'll skip the other ones because they're only going to be singles. Five SSRs, what are the odds of that? Well, they're actually 100%. Okay, wait, which Merlin is that? I, I don't know. Green Merlin? No, it's the other Merlin. I don't know if you can get Green Merlin from this. Oh my god, no. <laughs> I didn't have him, so it's a new unit, but okay, all right. <laughs> oh, mixed emotions about that right there. I mean, hey, new unit though, right? Red Helbrum. Probably getting close to six, six, six on Merlin. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, I didn't have a uh, Hendrickson apparently. Interesting. I thought I did. Maybe I, because I'm probably mis mixing him up with one of the SR Hendrickson's. All right, not enough tickets. Ah, oh, I thought I was gonna get a free SSR there. Will let me upgrade with four tickets to do a five pull. But all right, I'm gonna skip these animations here because they're just gonna be singles to end things off. Ew. Okay, that didn't happen. Just erase that from your memory. Erase it. Red Deanne. Oh, did I not have her? Really? It didn't coin. Interesting. Okay, I'll take it. Okay. And this is it. Red Helbrim. Nope. Don't tell me you can't. I think you can get Red Helbrim from this. Did they not add him yet? I'm, I'm sure they did. I just don't want, I want to make sure I'm not crazy. I don't want to be asking for somebody that, that I couldn't have even gotten. Oh, well, let me go back to it because I don't have any tickets to rip. I think you could have. All right, perfect. Now nobody will be able to tell that I actually got Eskinar early on in, in this video because it's pretty close in, in length to the last one. So thank you for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Uh, feel free to let me know in the comments how your summons have gone so far. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it. Until next time, this is Salt of the Salty Guild signing out.